give you a quick demonstration on making this interactive crossword puzzle in Excel. Please print out the instructions, but if you watch the video, it's also easier to show a short demonstration on how we did this. The instruction says to start in cell B2, and so you type in the letters exactly as shown on your instructions. We've got eggs across, sofa down, under the E over here we have easy, and across we have YMCA. And then the instructions want you to format the width and the length of these cells. So put your cursor on the A where you get that black arrow. Click and drag over through F. And we're going to format these cells right now. If I click between the letters, I get a big black plus sign. And I can click and I see the width is 8.43. I think the instructions have you make it 7. I do the same thing for the rows. So I'll get my arrow and click and drag row 1 through row 6. And in between any number, 4 and 5, I get a big black plus there. Any numbers will do that. And I think the instructions tell you to make it 50 pixels. So that's the size to make it. Now we need to format the cells with our letters. So I'm going to click, I want to highlight only the cells with the letters and nothing in between. So I'm going to click on my E, hold my control button down, and click and drag, and then I can let up on my my mouse and then I'll click again and drag, but because I've got my control button down, it highlights all of these letters. And now that I've got those letters highlighted, I can right click and format these cells. Right click, format the cells. Um, the assignment wants you to change the alignment so that we have both horizontal and vertical centers. So it's centered horizontally and vertically. We want to change the font size to be 24. And we want to put a border, both an outline border and an inside border, on our crossword puzzle. Then we'll click OK. Move that up so you can see. I'm going to click OK. There we go. Now I'm going to highlight the cells surrounding our crossword puzzle so that we can format those cells by clicking, holding my control button and click and drag these cells so that we can format these cells surrounding oops, surrounding our crossword puzzle. Click and drag. We'll get the cells in the center as well. And we want to come up and make a fill color. So I'll come up to the fill button and choose a color so that it's easy to see our crossword puzzle. Now we need to put clues. So I'm going to come up to my E and right click so that I can insert a comment. And across, I'll put a clue in like what a chicken lays. Chicken. I think I can spell that. And I need a down clue as well. How about for easy, opposite of hard. Okay. And I will do the same thing. I can right click on my S and insert a comment for sofa. Um, I can insert a comment that says what you sit on to watch TV. And I'll do the same thing for YMCA and come up with a clue. So when your person who is trying your crossword puzzle puts their cursor on the S, they've got the clue, or puts their cursor on the E, they have a clue.